I remember renting and buying movies. It was my favorite way to pass the time. My family and friends would also do movie nights. My parents would take me out with my friends to Hollywood Video or Blockbuster to rent movies and video games. I would go through row by row of movies to pick a couple for the weekend. Going through the rows was an amazing experience. I miss it. Then we would go back to my house and plop on the couch or floor and spend the whole evening watching movies and playing games. But then the worst happened. When Netflix streaming came out, more and more people started using it, making it to where no one would go to video stores anymore. Then one by one, video stores everywhere started closing down. No more looking forward for movie nights on the weekends. No more searching, exploring row after row to find that special movie. Family nights became less and less. It was all over. But that's sadly not the worst part of this story. Netflix became so popular that other streaming services started to be born, then rise to glory of entertainment. Hulu, Amazon Prime Video, Apple TV, Disney Plus, and so much more. At first, it was an amazing way to have so many movies to choose from on your TV without having to go anywhere. But nothing in this world is free, and streaming services were no exceptions. After a while, Netflix started raising their prices from $7.99 to $9.99 to $11.99 to $19.99, all the way up to $25.99. Then in the year 2027, they went too far. They raised the price to $140 a month. All the other streaming services did the same. It's now 2030, movies are now no more. Streaming got too expensive. Actors, directors, movie and TV show writers weren't getting paid. No one could afford to watch movies on streaming. Even rich people didn't want to spend that much money a month on streaming services. Throughout my life, I bought and collected movies on Blu-ray, DVD, and even VHS. And I'm happy to say I'm still able to watch them. Once streaming services got too expensive, people threw their TVs away because they didn't have anything to watch anymore. People now watch TikTok and Instagram videos all day. The world is truly a depressing place now. But I'll be okay. I still have my movies, the real entertainment.